everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome to Summer in the City Day 3. Just finished my workout with Katie on Fridays. We both work out together in the morning with our trainer, Jane. She's amazing. And now I'm actually headed to breakfast at Ruby's Cafe on Mulberry Street in Soho um, to meet my friend Gabriella. We met on an EF Ultimate break trip in Greece years ago, and she's in town today. So we're just grabbing some quick breakfast to catch up. got back from breakfast and on my walk back I stopped by and grabbed a little birthday bag and some tissue paper uh, because tomorrow as I told you guys I'm going to the Jersey Shore where my friend Daly lives and she's having a birthday party today's her birthday but tomorrow she's having the whole thing and me and my friend Amanda split a gift that we got her from Dagny Dover I feel like I can show you guys this vlog will go up yeah we we'll already have given her the gift so we're a-okay um, but yeah, we like got her a gift. So I'm gonna wrap that. Amanda got the card, I'll sign it, stuff like that. And then I just pulled out my duffel bag from Stony Clover. I love it, it says on the go. I got it customized because I'm gonna pack today. So I'm staying at our house just for one night tomorrow. I'm leaving at like nine in the morning or 10 in the morning tomorrow to go to her house and we're gonna have the beach and pool tomorrow. I might need a bigger duffel bag because I need to bring like a beach bag and like my swimsuit and stuff like stuff like that and then we're like going out I think I think so very very excited for tomorrow but today's an exciting day so we just got back I have about 45 minutes I had such a great workout with Katie it was so fun it was so lovely catching up with my friend Gabriella too there's a few girls from my sorority that were here in New York City and I was like oh my gosh they were sitting at breakfast next to us so I got to catch up with them so that was really really nice and yeah, that's that. Now, I am actually just gonna stay in this outfit kind of like I did the other day because one of the exciting things I am doing today is something I've never done in New York City before. I am going kayaking in the Hudson River. So excited. Um, I just think that's a really cool thing and you can definitely only do that in the summer here. So me and my friend Elizabeth, her name is Elizabeth Fowler. She is incredible, she does all the amazing TikToks about like places to go in New York City, restaurants to try, things to do. Like when I first moved here, her TikToks were popping up on my feed all the time. And I posted, um, you know, obviously that I was doing Summer in the City series. And she was like, if you need a buddy to do anything with, I've got you. She has so many amazing ideas and recommendations. So I'm so honored that she wants to do this with me. And I don't think she's ever kayaked on the Hudson River either. So very excited to do it with her. We're gonna go in like 45 minutes, like I was saying, and it's like a 45 minute, like you pay like $13 per person. You get a kayak, I think it's like a open facing kayak, so, um, which I prefer those. That's what I'm used to from being in the ocean. And I think it's like a little bit more uptown on like 44th Street or, no, it's like 12th Avenue. I don't really know. I have the directions. So obviously on the Hudson, we'll, kayak around you could either do it with someone or you can get like singles and we just thought it'd be fun to do singles um because you get a good workout and we could like take pictures of each other hopefully the water's not too rough it's a stunning day so i imagine it's gonna be great out there <laughs> gonna be great i sound like a camp counselor. okay it's gonna be a great day out in the river you know got this uh, so i'm looking forward to it it'll be fun and then we'll come back we'll shower we'll get ready because tonight ryan and i are going to guffall so many amazing performers tonight. Louis the Child, Quinn XCII, I don't know if that's the right way to say it. Lil Wayne, Jack Harlow, Kid Cudi. There are a lot of people tonight. It's crazy because tomorrow's lineup, there's like no one I'm really interested in seeing per se. So it's kind of perfect that I'm not going tomorrow because I can't. Then we might go on Sunday to J. Cole. We're gonna see. But tonight is the night. So I'm really, really excited to go. Brooke is going with her boyfriend too. Um, so we'll hopefully see them there. And I'm hoping that some of you guys are going and I hope that you guys say hi to me because I love meeting you guys. So obviously like the outfits, I still don't know what I'm wearing. How crazy, I'm going to a music festival and I still don't know what I'm wearing. But from what I gather, Gov Ball is kind of like Music Midtown in Atlanta, which is like, I mean, yeah, you wear a cool, fun outfit, but it's more like chill. It's not like Coachella where you're wearing like assless chaps and stuff. So I'm thinking to wear like baggy jeans and like a cute little tank, that kind of vibe. Yeah, and I think they have a clear bag policy, and I do have a clear bag from my Georgia game days here, but it's not really the vibe, so I don't know what to do. Might make Brian carry some stuff in his pockets. We'll see, we'll see. But yeah, that's kind of the lay of the land right now. 
Okay, so I just pulled a couple, I just pulled a couple pieces <laughs> uh, that I could wear. These are not in order of, like, this is obviously giving Halloween those wouldn't go together necessarily. I mean, they actually kind of look cool, but no. Um, these are like three tops and three bottoms. I don't know if any of this works. These, I forgot I have these cargo pants from Urban Outfitters. I love them so much. They're like light, very comfortable. But I was planning on jeans, but also these might get me hot. I don't know. And this is like this beautiful butterfly top. Like this with this, but like I always do that. Honestly, none of these are like screaming to me. Like I need like, I have this. Which could give Dunkin' Donuts, which I think would actually be really fun. Like a pink corset with orange pants. I don't know, that could be fun. But I don't know, I was kind of feeling more like different vibes. Or I could be like <laughs> how Hailey Bieber and Kendall Jenner were at Coachella and just wear like a white tank with this. Which could be fun too and like add jewels. So these are what I pulled, we'll see what happens later. So this is the gift that Amanda and I got for Daily because she has an, a Dagny Dover work bag, like a commuter bag, it's like a tote bag that she loves so much. And Amanda had the idea to get her a gift that had to do with commuting or something. And I was like, well, she loves her Dagny Dover bag. And then I walked in and I asked the lady, I was like, what is like a popular gift? And she said these fanny packs. And I was like, oh my gosh, Daily, like after she gets off work or like when she has, when she goes to work, she can wear her tote bag, but then wear this across her chest or for like hot girl walks and stuff. We were in between black or gray, but I think gray is more her. So yeah, I'm so excited. I really hope she likes it. I think she'll be really excited about it. Um, so I'm gonna wrap this. It did come in this beautiful dust bag, but I don't wanna just like hand this to her. So I'm gonna wrap this up too. Alrighty, we're about to go. I just sunscreened my entire body because um, it is powerful out there and put more on my face as well. Super goop on the face. I'm just wearing the same thing, but I'm bringing this little waterproof, well, semi-waterproof fanny pack that I got from H&M when I went to Lollapalooza, actually. It's fabulous. Also bringing a bottle of water. And we're gonna take a ginger shot together before I go. Taking one of these Vive ginger shots, and I always get these, but they're always like ginger and turmeric, whatever. This is just all ginger, which I saw for the first time at Whole Foods. I was very excited about that. Cheers, it's Friday. Cheers to our health, our wellness, and everything above. Huh. That feels great. Woo, let's go. All right, just got here. This is so cute. Oh my gosh, the gals. Hi. Oh my gosh, you guys look so cute. Hello, hello. Getting ready here. Love it. You ready, Elizabeth? I'm so ready. I'm so excited right now. <laughs> it feels amazing, out. It's the most beautiful day, I feel like, for this, and it's just... We're good here. Vibes. Yes, good vibes. This is very peaceful. I'm holding onto my phone like no other. Got the gang. This is so nice. Elizabeth brought us cookies. So sorry. We have three oats. Bumper cars. Here, Bumper kayaks. Three oh my gosh. Velvet, <laughs> and Oreo I love this. Cookies on the on and the bed. The last crumb, and apparently this place is like sold out. I've heard of this. Yeah, it's a huge thing on TikTok. Sick. Oh my gosh. Yes, I do. I just want like a half. I'd split with somebody. This is so peaceful. A little windy, but we'll take it. We have to stay in this little area, I will say. So if you want to be able to like go up and down the river, I think they do tours where you can like go with a guide, which makes sense because there's like a lot of boats out there. So we just stay between these like orange buoys, which I didn't know, but this is still vibey. Okay, you guys, I'm doing something I've always been scared to do in New York. I'm being dramatic, but <laughs> <laughs> I love biking. And these gals are biking back. So I think I'm gonna do it. So it's something fun to do in New York. It's so fun and it's a straight shot down the West Side Highway. So it's really not too bad. Got my tour guides. I know I am. What if you become like a passionate biker? All of a sudden I'm like a city biker. Yeah. Watch out world. Do I need to like get an app or something? Like, oh gosh, okay. Gotta go download the app. See you guys on the bike. I'm scared. All right, here we are. So I'm gonna, you want me, I should do an electric. Where do you put your water? You don't. I can put it in my bag. 
Um, oh, I don't want to make you do that. That's okay. This is. Oh, I might. Okay, things. If it gets too heavy. Oh, yeah, you'll just put it there. Got you. All right, here we are. This is actually really fun. Love it. I just got back. What an exhilarating experience I just had. I literally have never biked before because I love biking, everything, but I just wanted to do it with someone that like knew what they were doing. And like, so I was just gonna bike with them down the West Side Highway and then like say goodbye and they were gonna like ride their bike through the city. But guys, Elizabeth and I literally live so close to each other. It would be silly to be like, okay, bye. Like I'm gonna get in a car and be stuck in traffic and you get home for me. Like. You know? So there was like a couple parts I was like, oh my gosh. You're basically on the road, there's bike paths. But it was so fun, I'm so excited. I got home so much faster, I'd still be in the car right now. And that just marks another thing off my summer bucket list in New York City, so maybe I'll be a city biker now. It was nice though because she knew where we were going, she had done that route before, so she didn't need to like look at her phone for directions, she just led me the way so it was so nice elizabeth and hannah ended up coming too i love them both so much it was absolutely so much fun kayaking and then the biking it's just been an active day now i'm gonna take a shower i'm gonna wind down a little bit because i'm like i'm pumped up and um get ready for golf ball oh and get food okay outfit options for tonight i just got these shorts from free people i am obsessed with them i think i am gonna wear this top and this little belly chain this is fun but i think i like it better with the jeans which i'll show you guys in a second like long pants but i do like these shorts and i will be wearing them this summer i just think this is the vibe i still have to do my hair makeup i'm gonna have my hair down i think but i love it this top i think it's from super down off of revolve belly chain is from orium collective Jeans are good American. I haven't worn them yet, so I'm excited to break them out. They fit perfectly, perfectly baggy. We love it. I'll link them below. I'm obsessed. All right, we are all ready. I'm about to meet Ryan, and we're gonna head to GovVol. I have no idea what to expect at all. Don't know what that sound was. I just tried the balsamic and sparkling water challenge or seltzer challenge so go follow me on tiktok if you want to see what i thought at danielle underscore carolyn i believe it's my tiktok so yeah this is the outfit i already showed you guys i just feel good i feel free i decided i am gonna bring this clear bag that i have from game day but i just took the strap off because it was red and that's what i didn't like about it but i'll just hold it like a little little shoulder bag i did want to bring my sunglasses and lip stuff so yeah super group gave me a voucher on uber to take a car there, which I'm really thankful for. So we're gonna do that, but we might train back. So I feel like it's gonna be really hard to get Ubers back to the city. So that's that. I'm excited to see all the performers and to hang out with Ryan. Let's go transporting to my phone. A million people in the crowd, but I only See your face in all the lights And as the bass keep pounding on me, baby I really wanna make you mine I don't really care about love I don't really care about happy ever afters Something about you gives me hope Something about you, yeah hard kombuchas in and <laughs> when we first got here I was like ooh I don't know if this is the vibe but as the sun set Louis the child came on a little kid cutty Jack Harlow feeling it we had a blast so 
I'm happy. I'm happy. We're trying to find a car. Because the Uber is actually not a stressful thing here. Anyways, that was fun. This is gonna become a thing where I do these like little confessionals at the end of my vlog every time. Okay, when we first got to get ball, I was like, Ugh, like, I see why not everyone's obsessed with this. It's kind of random. But as the sun started to set, Jack Harlow came on. I started to have a couple more hard kombuchas. Like, we were vibing, we were vibing, we were vibing. What do we think of the side part? Everyone's saying I look like my mom with the side part, which I'm not mad about, but like, I feel like my hair looks thicker with the side part and I just feel more spunky. Or should I do a middle part? Please comment down below, like actually. I think the middle part looks good with my hair extensions, but, and like when I throw my hair, okay, well right now it looks voluminous with the middle part. I don't know, please comment down below, tell me your thoughts. We had so much fun at the governor's ball. Um, Lewis the Child was so good. I've seen them at Coachella before, and I think it was just the way the stage is at Coachella compared to the stage. I just felt more in it today, and it was so fun. It was so funny. I'm gonna talk about it on the podcast on Gals and Go, which will go up next Wednesday. I wrote like a ton of notes down, but one thing to note that I wrote down, it, Lewis the Child, like, I like them because they're not like too, too EDM, but like tonight they decided to be more EDM. And they were like, it was like the song, It's Strange, and I love it so much, but then it was like, <laughs> like it was like all beats, and Ryan goes, oh, this just makes me want to slow dance. And he grabs me, and we start slow dancing. It was the funniest shit of my life. It was so good. Um, but yeah, I'm very hungry. It's 11 o'clock, which I like about cup ball, and at 10. I think I'm gonna eat the rest of my Chipotle, and wash my face and go to bed because tomorrow morning we're headed to the Jersey Shore, baby. I'm excited to vlog. Tomorrow's vlog is gonna be a little bit different. I hope it's like long enough. It'll be long enough. It'll be long enough because we're gonna be in Daly and Amanda and Co. It's gonna be so fun. A ton of girls that I know from Georgia will be there tomorrow, so I'm so excited to take you guys to Jersey Shore. We're going to the beach in the day. Good night, guys. I love you. Thanks so much for watching Summer in the City series day three, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.